Hi, I'm Sherry from Savvy Apron, and I'm so excited to show you how you can make your own pillow even if you don't own a sewing machine. All you need is a pillow form, fabric, and whatever you're going to use to decorate your pillow with, and fabric glue. You want your fabric two inches wider than whatever your pillow form is. You take your fabric, pull it back, and you're going to draw your line of glue about a quarter inch from the edge of the fabric, and then press your fabric down all the way from one end to the other. Start at one end, draw your line all the way to the other end, and press it down. And we're gonna leave one side open to stuff the pillow. After your pillow's dried, turn your pillow inside out. Insert your pillow into the pillowcase, and tuck your ends together. I use chip clips to hold it. I'm gonna draw a line from one end to the other and let it dry for about 30 minutes. I'm gonna add pom-poms to my pillow. You need something ring-shaped. Just wrap your yarn around your ring and get a piece of string that you're gonna to use to tie your pom-pom with. Run the yarn around the pom-pom and tie it in a knot. Run your scissors up and just trim off all excess. Add some glue, place the pom-pom, and hold it for a few seconds until it dries. I'm gonna add a deer head. You can use a stencil or you can print off a free template. I like to trace onto something like plastic. It just makes it much easier to draw on fabric. Once you've traced your deer head and you have it cut out, you're gonna glue it onto your pillow. So turn your deer head over and add glue. You can take an old paintbrush and just spread it out a little bit. Put the head first, then add the antlers. And this is such a fun, easy, quick way to add a pillow to your home, even if you don't own a sewing machine. 